It was so long ago, so he can't remember all of the names. But no matter what that person's crime was, I don't think that the guard should be handcuffing them and beating the shit out of them or whatever. So if you want to go on and do it, then uh, uh, do it toe-to-toe, -to -toe, which we know they're not going to do that. So anyway, this is Paul Wizzo. Let my guest come on here and tell you what's happened with the Texas Department of Corrections. He asked for you guys to help it go viral, so share his story and share it. And then just ask the questions, why? Why none of the governors, why the governor didn't reply? Yeah, they probably get thousands of letters, but they hadn't seen it. The president, Bush doing. Uh, I'm not sure which Bush that was at that time. I can't remember. George, George, George Bush. Bush yeah. George Bush. The wardens from four different units. He's been handcuffed and he's been beat by the guards. Hit in the head, kicked, denied uh, medical treatment. Anything I'm missing? Punched, punched in the eyes and yeah. face. Right. And during all that time, they doing all this. Did you retaliate back? Did you try to fight back or anything? No. Nothing. Because you were handcuffed. Yeah. So you didn't try to kick or do anything. No. All right. Well, there you have it, everyone. So just coming on here sharing with you his personal story. And hopefully you guys will share it, pass it along, and listen to his story. And hopefully get to the right people so he can kind of get some justice. And maybe they can look up to see what... Um, uh, what do you call a damn over the guard, uh, over the prison? Director. The director to look up to see what director was over there and hold their ass accountable.